Wait, wait. We need some light. Uh, oh, can we have light? Thanks. Uh, <laughs> 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 right. Tonight, we're going to talk about the word character. We're going to discuss character dancing, dancing character roles, and dancing roles that require characterization. So what about the actual characterization? Did he talk a lot about how he wanted her to look? And I think that he expressed it with the movement. Right. And I think it was a couple of days before the premiere that I sat back and I watched um, Natalia Osipova with Marcelo as her Ivan. And it was the first time that I saw things that um, told the story. Uh -huh. And I didn't understand at the time when I was learning it why I was doing a certain move. And I looked, sat back and I was like, oh, that's what she's doing. She's saying something. When we talk about characters, people characters. One of the choreographers that you have to think about immediately is John Cranko. There was this belief in his dancers, right. and I think that's what made it. We were all kind of weird types well, in those sort of days. Well, misfits in we a way. We were misfits. He we took a group of people yeah. and made a unit out of that's you. That's right, we were misfits. That's you, a weren't, good... you weren't cookie cutters. Like... Well, we weren't these pretty bodies with all the legs and feet and all that stuff that other Companies, companies had, but one thing we could do was, as what I always say to my dancers in Stuttgart, a lot of people can do the steps, very few people can dance. Right. And what, one thing that we could do was dance, right. and he taught us how to That's dance, true. how to use whatever we did or did not have and make it into something that the audience would find interesting and, so, and, and would be theatrical. So, there he is. He's in his own thoughts. Now, ah, there you are. Shall we take a little stroll? He's totally bored, so he thinks maybe he should ask her what she's reading. It's a cheap French novel. Watch his face, what he thinks about it. She, she didn't see that, but you did. That's the important part. A very big thing for John was that, that he made his ballets for you, for the audience. It wasn't navel-gazing for him as a person. He wanted you to be entertained. He wanted it to be theatrical. And mostly, he wanted that you understood it. So his credo was, you should be able to come into a good full-length ballet. You're running late. You buy the program. As you come into the theater, the lights go down. You can't read it. And then the ballet should start, and you should understand absolutely everything that's going on without reading it. was beginning to think about his version and how it would be unique. He wanted to give some dimension to the character of von Rothbard. Kevin decided that not only should Odile be seductive and create mayhem in Act 3, but so should her father, von Rothbard. 